Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use Smart Noter AI. If you find this video helpful, please consider to like this video and subscribe to my channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into the video. Okay, the first thing what we need to do is download and install Smart Noter. So we can go to our Play or App Store and download it. Then from here for the first time, we need to go ahead and open up Smart Noter AI. Now, it will say Get Started. Click Continue, skip through all the welcome. We can pay for this, but in this demonstration, we can also use the free version. So we can even click out of it on the top left or click try for free. I'm just going to click out on the top left. And now it will say continue with Google or email. So I'm going to continue my Google account. It's going to be the quickest way. All right, I've chosen my Google account. Now it should redirect me back to the app and sign me up and sign me in at the same time. Okay, so you have a allow smart noted to send you notifications. Go ahead and click on allow or don't allow. Then after all that, we're going to be taken to the home page where we can create your first note. So we can record our audio. So record with your microphone, upload audio file. So we can upload audio video files, upload documents. So these can be either PDFs or other file types. Type or paste text. So manually enter a paste text. Meeting link. We can record and transcribe meetings and also paste YouTube URL. So type or paste your video link here. Now on the bottom, we've got these different tabs. So we've got Home, Notes, AI, Chat, and Profile. So if we go ahead and click onto Notes, now this is where all your stored notes from all of this is gonna appear. So where you're gonna create all your first notes. So that all gonna appear inside of here. Now if we move along to AI Chat, we can ask them questions. So we can ask Smart Note AI. For example, what can I ask Smart Note AI? How does Smart Note AI generate answers? I can go ahead and ask them that question. So basically they generate answers by analyzing the note history using tools to search for specific information and providing insights based on the content of the notes. Now, if we go to profile, this is where we can upload a new profile photo if you want. We can change our name, change email, we can change our password and all the other settings you typically find in apps like these. Now, if we go back to home, we can go ahead and record audio. So if you're sick of top sick and tired of drowning in notes, missing key details during meetings or lectures, it's time to start taking notes. It's time to stop taking notes the old-fashioned way. So if you go ahead and click on record audio, now it will say my recording. Now record at least two to three minutes for better context, speak clearly and at a steady pace, avoid background noise. So go ahead and start hit record if you are in a lecture, a meeting or a client call, or you can simply just leave a voice memo for yourself. And then what Smart Noter is going to do, it's instantly going to be begin transcribing your audio in real time. So it's basically like having your own personal secretary, always ready to listen and type for you at the same time. So for example, I'm just gonna go ahead and allow while using the app. So now it's gonna capture my voice while I'm making this tutorial. So I'm just gonna speak for a few more moments. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and click pause. And then we can save this. We can also add a photo. So say if you're in a lecture or a meeting or whatever, you can take a photo of where you are so you can reflect where you were. You can also add comments. Now, if you don't, if you want to delete that note, you can go ahead and click on delete. But for this demonstration, I'm going to go ahead and click on save. And now it's going to upload the file. So please stay on the screen while you wait. You don't want to click out of this, otherwise you're going to lose that note. Now, if we go back to notes after it's finished creating that note. So it says here, tutorials recording note it's going to give you the date time and the duration now let's go back into notes you can see here this is a recording here so if we click into it we can um, see the summary we can see the transcript and that's exactly what I said and also AI chat so you can um, ask them anything about your notes inside of here so that's basically how to use this application so if you want to make a new note go back to the home tab click on new note and then we can you know, record audio or these are pretty self-explanatory upload audio files, documents and all that stuff. Now, if you want to go ahead and share your note, we can do that as well. So click into the note. So here we can also click on the share button. We can um, ha create a public web link, share full text, export, even print it. If we click on to the three dots here, we can edit the title summary, edit the transcription, edit speakers, export details, and also delete the note inside of there. We can add this to a particular folder. We can create a new folder. So basically, Smart Note AI is a game changer for anyone who handles information daily. Now, this can be from students, study guides, to team leaders capturing meeting outcomes. It gives back your time by organizing your thoughts for you. So stop getting lost in the details and start focusing on what actually matters.